And welcome back. Today we are catching up with the very talented and very busy Sutton Foster. <laughs> now you may know her from starring in seven seasons from the hit TV show Younger. Or from her many performances on Broadway, including her Tony Award winning roles in Thoroughly Modern Millie and Anything Goes and more recently The Music Man oh, yes. with Hugh Jackman. Well, she is taking the stage yet again in the dark, funny and thrilling Sweeney Todd, the demon barber of Fleet Street. And Sutton is here with us this morning. Thanks for Good squeezing morning. us in. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's my pleasure. I love being here. Thank you. I, I think it's wild that you had five days between projects. So you, you're rehearsing for Sweeney Todd during the day, and then you're on stage with Once Upon a Mattress at night. I yeah. Mean, how, how did you juggle all of that and keep it all in your brain? I don't know. I um, <laughs> I like. I, I sort of think of things like a, it's a stovetop. So I put things that I'm working on. Okay. I put it on the front oh, burner. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. And then you sort of move things around. And it's like, and, and I'm a mom too, so I mm. feel like I'm really good at multitasking. Yes. How old are your kids? I have a daughter. She's going to turn seven. You have a oh. seven year old. Oh, okay. Yeah, you are multitasking. Yeah, so it's, it is. And, and I, uh, if you look at the mountain, it's impossible. But mm -hmm. if you just take it one little bite at a time, mm -hmm. yeah. you know, you, it's amazing it what you can do. I'm yeah. Use that burner analogy. That's a good one. Yeah. So you play Mrs. Lovett in this show. Talk to me about this accent. We hear you have this poem. Oh. It like snaps you right into it. Well, I've never done. I'm, I was born in Georgia, so I was I grew up with a crazy Southern accent. Okay. But Mrs. Lovett is has a Cockney accent. Mm -hmm. I've never done a Cockney accent before, so I worked with an amazing. Um, and I was really intimidated and scared, and I worked with an amazing uh, dialect coach named Deborah Heck. She's done, and so she gave me a poem to do. Okay. And of course, I'm probably going to offend like every <laughs> everyone if I do it. But I tried to do it before. And I was like before the show, but okay. um, I'll see if I can do it. Uh, uh, Sir Brian had a pair of boots with great big knobs on. <laughs> he walked among the villagers and blipped them on the head on Tuesdays and on Saturdays, but mostly on the latter days. So that's sort of what I do. Oh, wow. really cool. <laughs> but it is wild. Get you right into a little it. bit. Yeah. Yeah. That's, awesome. that's why she's a professional. I love it. <laughs> Quickly, she yeah, was you did. Well done. Uh, and as someone from South Carolina, I know it's not easy no, to, no. to drop that accent. Yeah. And oh, yeah, yeah. I, 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 a little birdie told us you're a, you're a Patti LuPone super fan. I am a Patti LuPone. I'm her number one fan. Like, and it started when you were a teenager. Mm -hmm. And then the same little birdie also told us she showed up on an opening weekend. She did. She came to my third performance, and we have become friends which is like wow. still Wild. like blows my mind there she is yeah and she came to my third show and I was like Patty why are you at my third show but then I also realized I will never be ready to perform for Patty LaFone but I was so thrilled she's amazing and I just um yeah I think I will always be I'll always show up with the foam finger you know she's my yeah. <laughs> she invited you to go out after she did and, and I was so tired and I know I can't believe I turned her down I know she's like oh, are you coming out and I was like no I've got wow. a matinee tomorrow <laughs> But we have, we're going to have a makeup date. Okay, so, good. yeah. Very right scheduled. scheduled. Yes. Which is confusing because given all your stuff going on, you also have a, a side hustle where you teach a dance exercise class. And you've got exercise like Jonathan Graff, Jennifer Garner taking What? Class. What, yeah. what, what do you oh, yeah. oh, my gosh. Yep. Okay. So, so what happens in a Sutton Foster <laughs> dance class? <laughs> so, yes, I, do, I love to exercise. I love to dance. Um, I, there's this wonderful uh, community and a, and a wonderful fitness started by my friend Beth Nicely. Mm -hmm. It's called The Limit. The Limit, yeah. And it's, it's hard. It's very hardcore. And she opened her studio about a year ago in Chelsea. And I said, I would love to, I jokingly said, I'd love to teach a class. And she was like, okay. And then I started teaching and I wow. fell in love with it and developed a, a community of of regulars mm -hmm. and a lot of my music is like it's all from the 80s and stuff that I grew so up listening fun. to and it's just an hour where you don't think about anything awesome. you just get to dance all your troubles oh, away oh my gosh you've got so much wisdom and knowledge and in fact we've got a question for you from uh -oh. uh, 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 some friends at a Tamunqua, Tamunqua uh, area high school the drama club in Pennsylvania okay they are putting on their own production of Sweeney Todd this spring and so here's their question okay oh my gosh. Hi Sutton, we want to know, in Sweeney Todd, what's your favorite line of dialogue and why? Oh my gosh. <laughs> um, what is my favorite? Wait, remember all your lines. I know, now yeah, I'm like, oh, oh my what's gosh. my favorite line of dialogue and why? Well, I, there's a great, she has a great, I immediately thought about, this is probably, she's, <laughs> there's a great line she says in, where she's telling him, um, well, since you're so up for a little, that's the throat to slit, dear. <laughs> so she's wow. trying to, literally a front row seat. Yeah. Yeah. To just a master class in how to be. Uh, that was awesome. That's probably a little much for morning no, television. No, no. 
Yeah, that's so yeah, yeah. But it just reminds me of all the young folks too who do these musicals. My mom used to teach music theater. Like you know, they're watching you guys. And you're trailblazing for them, and they learn from you, and they admire you. So thank you. Well, yeah. thank you. Thank so you. Much. Thank you. And they have their own their own trails to yes, blaze. Yes, absolutely. You know? So they can. It's. I'm thrilled to be able to be doing. I'm. It's my turn now. I it's, love it. It's going to be there. Exactly. Exactly. Well, thank you so much. Thank you. It's Thanks so fun to have me. you here. Run and run. run. Don't, don't walk. walk. <laughs> don't walk. <laughs> to catch Sweeney Todd on Broadway until May 5th. <laughs> Hey, thanks for watching. Don't miss the Today Show every weekday at 11 a.m. Eastern, 8 Pacific on our streaming channel, Today All Day. To watch, head to today.com slash all day or click the link right here.